book review time. I got this audiobook called The Pleasure of Finding Things Out, the best short works of Richard uh, Feynman. So Richard Feynman, if you don't know already, he is one of the most famous kind of scientists, physicists. He worked on the nuclear bomb. He somewhat regretted that, but he's just a brilliant guy that just understands science and makes science interesting and fun and just such a creative mind of, of our times. Really good teacher. I read this one because I felt like, you know, this guy's really interesting and I love hearing what he has to say. I found there's a lot of value in it, but you may have heard some of the pieces of stuff that he's, he's talked about. Uh, there, it's just one of those things that will get you to think deeper and to understand things better. He was just a, an excellent person, right? I think a lot of times people want to put people in a box. I get this happen, happen, this happens to me all the time on this channel where people are like, oh, you can't be an expert in all these things. You can't talk about the, all these things. Well, you know what? Sometimes when you gain some expertise and wisdom in many different areas, they allow you to short circuit the beginning phases of other areas. He's just this kind of brilliant mind that has put together <coughs> a lot of good wisdom from different areas. He's not just a physicist. He looks at the world as more than physics. And he's he's really just an interesting character, right? I mean, just when you hear his stories about working on the nuclear bomb and, and those the laboratories that, that he worked in where he was like learning how to pick locks in people's file cabinets and, and just the way that his mind works is curiosity. I think it, it's missing today. So if you're if you're a fan of his work, if you're a fan of him, if you're a fan of science, I think you'll find this enjoyable. You know, it, it's not a book that, that you read and then you're like, oh, there's like some huge takeaways from this. But there's probably a few in there that you'll find. I just find it entertaining to, to listen to him and it's inspiring to me to listen to someone who is so well educated but is a, is a thinker. He's a philosopher, physicist, really, I would say, right? He, he, he has the bulldog mindset, right? He attacks things and he goes after them. And so, uh, you know, I, I really enjoyed that. So, you know, definitely not my favorite book of all times. It's a compilation of things. So it is like some loosely connected pieces. I'll warn you about that. But if you, if you like Feynman, if you, if you find his other works and his, just his manner of, of style and speaking and teaching to be beneficial, then I would recommend this one. So you can check it out here at the pleasure of finding things out. And uh, that's all I got for you today. I'll talk to you guys next time. Take care.